Nutrisystem Live. I'm Linda. And this is Ryan. Hey, how you guys doing? And today we're talking about um, getting maybe getting a little bit more on track, maybe you fell off for Halloween or whatever. So we thought we would come up with some of what we call our tasty takes on Nutrisystem food. So what this is, is we have foods that we already have, and then we've just kind of added some extras to it. And we've got a breakfast, a lunch, a dinner, and a snack. Yeah, I think that we're, um, you know, it's always great to have uh, your favorite entrees, but maybe we can give you a couple of ideas on uh, how we think you can spice them up a little bit. Definitely feel free to tell us how you're spicing them up a little bit. Uh, we're always looking for new ideas. A lot of people that are on Facebook and our social channels are always looking for great ideas, and a lot of you always do give good ideas, so we're hoping that you'll be able to take a couple away from here today. Totally true. If you have any suggestions, please let us know because again, we he we hear these things and we want the we want everybody to know. So let's get started with breakfast. So what we got, what we have is Right, you want to explain what we have here? Yeah. So this is kind of our take on a on a breakfast melt that has. Um, that uses our honey wheat bagel. So uh, what you're looking at here is uh, the honey wheat bagel. We put some provolone cheese on it, uh, tomato. So you got like a little breakfast melt, uh, a little spice on the top of it. Uh, you could maybe do like an Italian season or something like that. And then you can use the extra tomatoes right on the side. So uh, this will count as one uh, breakfast entree because you're using the, um, the honey wheat bagel. You will have a power fuel as well. And then you'll have one extra. Um, so the, uh, and then this, uh, we use provolone, but on the leaf, you can also, we mentioned also using maybe shredded mozzarella. If you have a different type of cheese that fits within the power fuel range, 80 to 120 calories, then definitely feel free to use that as well. But, uh, the recipe again, all these recipes will be on the leaf, but it's very easy. We honestly, we just took this bagel, we cut it in half, uh, we added the ingredients on top of it, warmed it up in the microwave, and um, or you can use a toaster oven as well. And then you have a great breakfast. Only takes a, about two minutes to make. Actually, I think it took less than two minutes to make because I Good. think we were in and out of. But anyway, so on this is uh, Italian seasoning, and um, we put um, and some fresh basil. So those are free, so you yep. can have those. But uh, I loved that, that when we were making, these things smelled so good, and then, I mean, we were done so fast. We have a bunch I more, know. but like we were done like really quick. So we are going to move on to lunch. Oh my gosh, this one I love. This is buffalo mac and cheese, uh, sorry, with, with chicken in it. So uh, we were making this, and it's kind of amazing here, right? Yeah, you talk it is. About it? it is really good. Now we used a little ramekin bowl here. You can use whatever you would like. Um, ramekin probably does the best job, but this will count as one Nutrisystem entree, and then you'll have one power fuel as well. Uh, so essentially, you can take your basic rotisserie chicken. Uh, maybe you have some leftover chicken that you baked up for power fuels for the week, and you're just going to cut them, cut them up little pieces. You know, you take a power fuel servings worth. You'll use. Uh, we use used a, um, a buffalo chicken sauce, so like a, you know, kind of like a Tabasco only buffalo chicken. So it adds a little bit of spice if it, uh, just in case, you know, spicy is not really your thing. Um, but you will mix that together. You make up the mac and cheese, uh, just you, you use the instructions on the cup, and then you mix it all together. And uh, you have this, again, um, really easy, only a couple minutes. And it's just such an easy way to mix up that mac and cheese. And Let's be honest, the white cheddar mac and cheese is amazing by itself. So if you're taking that and you're combining it with some buffalo chicken, I, I mean, it's a match made in heaven, a perfect pair. It is totally a perfect pair. And you know how your mother told you not to play with food? Well, now you can. So I like to play with the food. And, and actually in the buffalo mac and cheese, the... Um, the buffalo sauce, we only put a teaspoon in, so you know, you can definitely do that today. So, oh, okay, hi Janelle. Breakfast hey, is one Janelle. of my favorite meals of the day. I love topping fa, fahe total, yogurt with Nutrisystem. Oh, with the granola cereal. Oh, okay, so she has a, has a, a combo there. Yeah, what? that's awesome. So, um, granola cereal is, is cereal is definitely a fan favorite of a lot of people. So, um, it, we, I, and like people will combine it with yogurt all the time, maybe put some fresh fruit on top of it. Um, I definitely think that's a great idea. A great way to just get an easy breakfast in. Good job. Let's move on to playing with our food, but playing with dinner. So this is something that you wouldn't actually recognize 
This is uh, the turkey medallions, and we did something really special with them. So I'm gonna ask Rye. Here you go, Rye. Hang yeah, on. So Let me pull it over again, there. if you uh, take a look on the leaf um, under dinners, we have this shepherd's pie. Wait, it's called skinny shepherd's skinny pie. Skinny shepherd <laughs> pie. That's right. I'm sorry, not your regular shepherd's pie. So again, this will just be a, a Nutrisystem dinner entree, and it will have uh, one vegetable as well. Add one vegetable as well. Um, I, very, very uh, simple to make. Um, it does have a little bit more ingredients than uh, some of the other items, but that's okay. You know, a lot of it can uh, be just stuff that's already cut up for you if you buy uh, cut up stuff at the grocery store um, that you can buy. And you have peas, carrots, you know, stuff like that, a little garlic. And then you can use the potatoes from the entree to cover uh, as, as normal shepherd pie would be with mashed potatoes. So it's very easy, very hearty. Um, and we, you know, we really think that's a great great dish. It's very easy. We do. And hi, Sherry. Uh, Brian is upstairs and you ordered a la carte from him. So that is very good. So you can definitely play awesome. with, you can definitely do some of these things with any of the a la carte meals. But with the, the turkey medallions, we actually took the turkey out of the tray that came in. So we cooked it and then we cut them up into pieces and then put them in uh, in this bowl. And, um, and, you know, we only covered half of it with the the, for the skinny shepherd pie, but that is something that um, that you know you can kind of do to taste, and then you bake it with a little paprika on there. So you <laughs> can, a little paprika, yeah. Um, and then so now we're going to move on to dessert. Absolutely. So the, Ryan absolute, made this one. Yeah. So I here, we're, he's proud. Yeah, I did. <laughs> so this counts as uh, one snack and one extra. Again, recipe is on the leaf. Uh, so this is a decadent fudge brownie. Um, so easy, and it has mint in it. So if if you're a real mint person, like you like mint chocolate chip ice cream or something like that, who doesn't like that? Yeah. Uh, this is a good way to get an alternative. So essentially, all all you're doing is you're taking the fudge brownie, cutting it in half, and then there's a couple of ingredients. Again, they're on the leaf. Um, you just mix those together. I mean, it literally took me one minute to make this. You mix them together, and then um, actually took a little bit longer because I guess I had a smaller tablespoon serving, but uh, <laughs> it's very very quick. Um, and then you you're just gonna layer the middle with the filling and then put this on top. Maybe you might want to warm it up just a tiny bit. Um, really, really awesome. It's completely just so easy. The mint tastes awesome in it. Mint and chocolate go really well together, especially and cream cheese. So um, we think that you'll really, really like this one. Um, if you have uh, any other additions to it, like sometimes uh, maybe somebody might put like some sugar-free chocolate syrup on it, just kind of spice it up a little bit. I mean, very good dessert. Yeah, so this one was great, and uh, and Ryan, I mean, he 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 like he made this thing. This yeah. was it, this was so great, and uh, it's cream cheese and it's fat-free cream cheese and a little mint extract, and then we have our fudge brown with our fudge like it's like a little sandwich. You slice your you slice your fudge brownie in half, and you get to play with your food. This is the yeah, theme here. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Hey, Ron. Really nice to see you. I guess oh, I'll be ordering desserts next. Oh, <laughs> well, Sherry's you a should. Good yeah, idea. absolutely. We we oh, think wait. that you should. Okay, so Sherry's concerned. Talk to her about that. Go on now. I feel a bit tight in the pants trying not to gain it back. Yeah, Sherry, I mean, definitely maintenance. A lot of people talk about maintenance as kind of the acid test, you know. Um, not that losing weight isn't difficult, you know. There's a lot of challenges that come with that, but you know, reach out to the counselors. Uh, they're available 7 a.m. to midnight Eastern Standard Time every single day. And uh, they are, you know, just waiting for your call or you can chat with them live. Um, the When it comes to maintenance, you know, um, it, having Nutrisystem as backup is definitely good. Yeah. You know, it helps you to get through some of these times like we were just talking about Halloween and different swaps, you can do that. We'll have other stuff coming up. Um, you know, we'll have other uh, videos coming up for the other holidays. It's not the gaining, but inches instead. Well, uh, sometimes that's uh, that's where it can happen too. So uh, one of the things we would recommend there is um, if you are exercising, uh, definitely um, pick up on that a little bit. You might want to help with the it, to help the intensity. Um, and then also, if you're not doing any exercise, it might be a good time to start just incorporating a walk if you can, or even if you have some exercise bands, um, stuff like that can really be a good start to trying to help uh, keep you know any um, to keep that that. Uh, uh, keep those maintenance um, pounds stable.
totally agree. So getting back to our tasty takes. So I just wanted to show you the, the packages. This one is the honey wheat bagel. I know it's backwards or something we can do. This is, this is the price of live television. And then this was the, the mac and cheese that we made. So we just put chicken in this and uh, buffalo sauce. And this is a brownie. I, I know, I love the desserts. Um, yeah. Oh, you're welcome, Sherry. We are, are happy to help you're you. You're welcome. So can you tell us again about the, the counselors and, and what they can do to help yeah, you? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, really, a, a, a very um, a big point of what we like to do at Nutrisystem is provide support for our for all of the individuals that are using our program and people that have and people that are having questions that maybe are thinking about joining our program. We have our weight loss counselors. They are available 7 a.m. to midnight Eastern Standard Time every single day. Um, you know, no question, no question is unwelcomed. You, you can contact them uh, by phone. You can contact them via live chat, uh, email, whatever you would like. You know, and um, it, also if you have any questions, feel free to ask them on social as well uh, we do have uh, our moderators available to talk to you about any questions or concerns you may have and we really love hearing from our from our fans and uh, love answering it's what makes us tick every day when we come to work yeah oh, our social care people are are kind of the bomb. I mean, they're they're totally amazing. So we want to try to encourage everybody. The reason that we like to come to work every day is because we get to help people like you. So if Absolutely. you have questions uh, about the program, feel free to ask. And then if you have any recipes that you want to share, feel free to share them with us or on this this um, this Facebook Live. We're happy to take a look at them. And we're going to take a look at the ones that are. Um, that are um, put out there. Thank you, thank you, Sherry. Anyway, so we'll take a look at those and see if we can maybe include some more tasty takes. And if you're looking for any of these recipes, it's the tomato and cheese bagel, um, the buffalo oh. mac and cheese, the skinny shepherd's pie, and the decadent grasshopper bars. You can look for all those on the leaf, and the link is right here on the on our Facebook Live, right there in the link. So you want to say bye? Yeah, absolutely. And one thing I want to say is, as we're coming up into the holidays, like if you have any uh, questions about um, specific entrees that you're looking for, maybe some tasty swaps on that you would want us to do videos on, definitely let us know. I mean, we love doing them. We have a ton of ideas on the leaf that we're happy to present to you live. Um, and again, it, it really helps, uh, makes us feel good to help you guys. So um, keep those suggestions coming. Uh, let us know what you think, what you uh, what you would like to see, and we'll try to bring it to you. I hope you guys have a great day. See you next time. Yeah, take care. Bye. Bye.